men one final rose. Last night, Becca made her decision during the finale of The Bachelorette, sending someone she loved packing and accepting a proposal from another. So here to break it down, I can't do it alone. I got my guy, my fellow Bachelorette bro, comedian. Russ Williamson. Thank you, Jordan. It's very nice that you brought your rose along. What an emotional night. It oh. was uh, something like we've never seen before. It's very true. It was okay. a guy crying. I cry every day. I've what? never seen it before. You didn't stop crying. Oh, my God. Like Both of them. 14 minutes in, the people were crying nine times already. It was way too much crying. It was like they were being sent off to war. So the final <laughs> two minutes we predicted were Blake and Garrett. There you get a look at them. They actually kind of look alike. Yeah. Becca's family met the final two. They loved them both. But let's talk about the tears. Garrett was waterworks from the word go last night. You don't come believe. on. <laughs> He's actually a handsome crier. I, uh, Most people are ugly criers. Oh, he I'm, actually I'm had the a good worst. <laughs> I, I did that to my uh, to my wife's uh, sister when I tried to uh, court her. Yeah. Like, <laughs> ah, ah, I didn't love her so much. I never heard her. I could understand half the stuff you say. Was it? Did you think it was genuine? Did you believe it? Ah, uh, I guess. I, who knows? Who knows if it's genuine? These guys are on a reality show. Yeah, find, right. It's hard to find that's love. The thing. So then Blake, to his credit, he almost had like the sixth sense. Like he knew he wasn't getting that rose. We all in the final know end. when it's not jiving. Yeah, and, and, and there he is. So there's a little bit of rain. You'd think Garrett uh, would have lost Becca, though. Garrett, not Blake here. You would have thought Garrett would have lost Becca with lines like this one. You give me eagles. Uh, well, that's like that. that I Haley wanted to come through the screen and like <laughs> choke slam him when he That's like that Haley Steinfeld song. It's like, you don't give me butterflies, you give me the whole damn zoo. It's, uh, it's, it's, <laughs> I've never heard that. You've never heard that? that <laughs> Uh, that, that's uh, that's a dumb line. And that is a very dumb line. And that's worthy you know, of losing the man. Right she should have been like, you know what? Uh, can I walk you out? I'll walk you out. Yeah, that's it. I'll walk you out. Uh, Blake, you're up, buddy. All right, but in the end, she did have to let one down in pursuit of eternal love. Sorry. Blake ha should, has a lot of reasons to be upset. You strung him along all the way to the end. Mm -hmm. You made this guy put on a suit, proposed to you in 150 degree heat. Like a nine piece suit. My man was sweating like Jordan Cornette in the second hour of the jam. <laughs> he was sweating. Like, it was he crazy. Was, he was sweating like uh, Russ all the time. Yeah, I mean, can we relate? <laughs> Big guys can relate to that. I was watching. I was like, oh, no, she's about to say no, and his face is just pouring. But sweat. why did she make him go through with all that? Why That's didn't she thing. just, like, he walked up and she was like, you know what? Just listen. Uh, we got to go. We got to talk to you. <laughs> I just, I didn't get it. I don't know what was worse, the sweat or the tears right there. It was just, it was really, really weird stuff. If he started throwing up, it would have been like uh, my proposal. <laughs> On the other hand, though, Garrett proposed, and it did come out pretty well. Yes. Oh, I love love, We Jordan. found love, I love finally. love love. At the end of the three-hour bonanza. Oh. Garrett found his girl. I can't wait till he takes her back to his farm. <laughs> Is this going to last? Then, no. It's not going to last. It's ne it never lasts. They're going to be on Bachelor in Paradise next year. <laughs> Is Blake going to be the final Bachelor? Or uh, the next Bachelor? I think so, yeah. It's either him or uh, Colton, because they got good stories. <laughs> Colton the Virgin? You oh, think? yeah, because there's going to be girls lining up to, to take that V card. To, to go ahead and steal that V card. Russ, it was a great season, my friend. Oh, what a season, Jordan. You want to uh, say bye to your... your, your... Mwah, mwah. And everybody at the Brick House, we had a good season, yeah. and we'll see you next time. We'll have you back for uh, Paradise One of hey, them. There's I'll always be something, here. right? I'll be here.